Pros versus Joes. We're pumped up for this. You guys really enjoyed the last episode. Now on today's episode, we're going to see Arturo Gotti slumping dudes, dropping people, not going very easy on them. Let's get into it. What's cracking, everybody? I'm Petrus Papadakis. And I'll say it again. If you missed the last episode, don't say what's cracking ever in your life, even if it's 2006, 2010 time period. Yes. Pros versus I'm Petro Papadakis. Everyone in the comment for the last episode were going, Steve, Petros Papadakis was a UCC player, phenomenal football player, as well as a really good sports announcer as well. I can tell. He has a great voice. Hey, Joes are here representing the <laughs> hey. bracket of the Sudden death, Here's baby. Let's go. Run. Two punters will kick to our Joes. Joes must run the ball back for a touchdown in order to move on. <laughs> So unfair. Two Joes are scrambling so much chance involved. Right Look at these guys. Two right hands. Two left legs, these guys. He turns out the field. Thanks, right? Bah, I gave him the Heisman situation of life. Uh-oh. Face mask. He's got open field in front of him. Bah, he got it. Good job from Mike Hall, number one seed. That's a thinker. Mark Boland's a thinker. Some tired ass Joes. Oh! Concussions. This is such a dangerous show. This oh my god. Fahim Hammett. Oh! This is not good. I mean, it's great TV. Don't get me wrong, but these guys are getting killed. Yo, yo, he ran the other way. Love it. Love to see it. Robert Foster it up. Look at him, look at him, fast legs, boy. He's done. Watch this, watch this. Oh, it's over. It's over. And all the agony and extreme exhaustion of I'm ready. I want a Snickers as well. What's his name? It's Ricky Williams. Playing football. You better pray it's not me. Yeah, pray. 12,000 rebounds. 15 times he took his team. 12,000 rebounds. Great. Charles. Oakley. Legend of the game. Legend of the game. Beast. Stop now. 140 fights with 31 knockouts. He's one of the most feared fighters. Let's go. Legend of the game. God bless the dead. Arturo Gotti. You better show some respect for boxing legend Arturo Thunder. Got it. Yo, you gonna make a tour run across the whole field in boxing shoes? Who wants to fight over here? I do it. And then you guys, I do it. I'll see you in the square circle. Let's go. I love it. I love it. I love. I love how men specifically have this preconceived idea that they can just naturally fight, especially if they have a height advantage or weight advantage. They just go. They were all scared of the football player and the, the basketball player, but when a, a smaller boxer comes out, they go, Shit, I'm, I'm a man. I could definitely punch, right? Jesus gave me a, the ability to punch, right? But the fact of the matter is, if you have not trained it, you're going to learn the hard way. Stay tuned. How are you that big? What's your genetic strain situation looking like? What's your DNA sequencing is what I'm asking. Ricky. You are Ricky Williams, a Heisman Trophy winner and current NFL player. That's disrespectful. That's what I do. Well, well, right. Makes sense in that case. Mike, you get to choose between Arturo. Please box. Arturo, who do you want? Arturo. You want a box? I want a box. You sure about that now? I'm sure. All right. I'm ready. And Arturo's happy. He's like, all right, I got a pretty small guy. Let's go and get it. In this matchup, you have one job, and that is to stop Ricky Williams. He's a pro bowler. You are not. <laughs> in case you forgot, you have not accomplished anything in your life. You are a failure, and your parents are ashamed of you. You got four downs to stop him. Whoever stops Ricky the most is going to win this matchup. You're the linebacker. I do the last time your mom sees you without a big giant dent in your head. All right. I really expected to be a pro football player, everything. After I, I broke my hand in high school, my first game, so I chose to join the Navy. Those stories break my heart. Come on, Mike Hall. This is a chance to prove that you could have made it in the NFL, provided you didn't break your hand. Oh! I guess I, that's what they consider a tackle. He can try to hurt him. Everything I do every day is for my family, and I came out here for me. All right, so he talked all this game, and you know, Strangle Gang, we want to see this guy get run over by Ricky Williams. Run his ass over. <laughs> watch, watch, watch this. He's going to kill him. 
Oh, he did it. He did it. Hmm. Interesting. He knows. Mike, you have no chance. Look at that. The speed on those legs, right? The athleticism is crazy. Football players and gymnasts are two of the greatest athletes in the world. Uh, just what it takes to make it in the NFL and to actually have a remarkable career in the NFL, um, it's it's just a rare thing. Come on. Oh, humble pie, served cold, CTE, broken clavicle. You ain't going to stop a Williams boy. I really didn't. We're gonna get our medical staff to come take a look at Robert. Robin Foster. I'm really dizzy, you see. Look at him, look at him, look at him. Look like a little bitch now. He had all that, all this. Now he's a little bitch. <laughs> it's just, just it, you can't write this, man. This is great. So he is out. By call, you get the victory. You're getting on. And then you guys have a neck brace? Yeah. You're gonna need one. <laughs> Let's get it cracked. Get the locker room. Mark Bowling, Johnny Frazier. You guys are taking on Arturo Thunder Gotti. If you've never seen it, check out his trilogy with Mickey Ward. One of the best trilogies of all time. Up there with Ali and Frazier. Three minutes. We got two boxing judges. Whoever they determine does the best against Arturo is moving on to overtime. The other is going home. My mantra of life, go out there and try it. They don't succeed either way. At least you try it. So the ring gentlemen. Kind of a likable guy, to be fair. Turbogati coming out, looking real comfortable. Good jab, changing levels, looking to get a reaction from the Joe. Good head movement, just really just flowing. Nice, pumping the jab to the head and body. Jab to the head, jab to the head, just gauging distance. Just trying to set him up, nice jab. Wobbled him with a jab. Oh, beautiful combination by Turbogati, left hook to the body. Watch this, he's probably gonna go high now, right? Oh, puts him down. He worked him to the liver with a left hook to the body, and then when he get back to open space, he faints low. You drop your arm, your right arm, to defend against the hook to the body, and he comes over to your glove with the, the hook to the head. So just basic body head work there. Stay down. Oh, look how awkward he is, you know? Guy was never boxed, like, what are you doing? Oh, right hand. Oh, his legs are gone. He got those volleyball legs right now. Oh, my God. He's trying to look for the net. He's like, there's no net. There's no net. Oh, that left hook took his nose off. Another left hook. He's down on his knees. Knocked him out. Thank God that's over. That That's bad. That could be a death. Like, a troll could kill him. If you can go for more than a minute 30, Donnie. You're gonna win and you're going on to overtime. Mark is going home. Donnie Frazier, you're ready to take on Arturo Thunder Gotti. Oh. Get in there. <laughs> Are you ready to do it? Time. <laughs> says, says something that's just arbitrary because doesn't want to say he wants to do it because he doesn't want to get crushed. He's like, please go easy on me. Now listen, I think he's a little bit bigger than the previous guy. So let's see how he does with just having sure. more body weight. I'm just, I'm gonna, you know, use my jab, yeah. jab to the body, yeah. jab to the head, see yeah. how aggressive he gets. Yeah. If he gets aggressive, I'm not pumping up because yeah. he's a bigger guy. So yeah. you got to watch him. All right. That's true. That's just a perfect breakdown. But you got to respect size no matter how skilled you are. I mean, a big guy hits you. It is what it is, right? But he doesn't have any real power. No, it's nice jab to the body. Nice jab to the head. He's going to look to come over the top with the right hand. There we go. There it is. Thank you, Petros. Uh-oh, oh, oh. He's working the body and the head. He's trying to get past those long arms. The issue is when you're fighting a guy who's so scared and so defensive, he doesn't open up to give you openings. He's just, oh, nice right hand over the jab. He's fainting him with the right hand so he can come over the top of the left hook now. Gotti working the body. Oh my God, he's swinging that air, hilarious. Donnie, you gonna fight or? Right hand to the head, love to see it. Slumped him, slumped him. Hit him with the overhand right, right in the cerebellum, sent him back to the corner. All he has to do is get up. You gotta get on him. You gotta get on him, Arturo. Quick. He got it. He passed him in 30. But there's only one way out, and that's by knockout. So, really rough, man. I don't think so. 
<laughs> nice hook. Nice hook. You rocked him. You heard him? You heard him? You heard the sound effect? You heard the sound effect? Get back up. Shorten your lifespan for us, for the entertainment of the general public. Don't let him out, Arturo. You there we go. Nice liver shot. You heard him? He said, damn. Well, like I said, it's always easier for the second guy because he can kind of see where the first guy went wrong and make adjustments. For instance, this guy just ran away for the whole round. If the first guy would have did that, he definitely would have lasted longer. Next up, Fahim, Kevin, on the hardwood with Charles Oakley. Let's Charles go. Oakley. Oh, this guy's no, taller than anyone I've ever seen in my life somehow. When the Oak pulls down 10 rebounds, it's over. Whoever scores the most is going to win. See him there, Fahim with the rebound. Come on, don't even Fahim let him get close to the basket. Oh, 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 beat it. Defense. Get him frustrated. Stop. One rebound for Oakley. Stop. Yo, he's rebound trashing these guys. The diesel. Ah, he just let you. He just let you. He doesn't have to do anything. Look at Oakley. Look at Oakley. Stop. Fahim didn't get one point, dude. Seven rebounds for Oakley. Hooks three. He's got one. Let him get one, Oak. Fahim puts it up. Oh, get rid of Air ball. Two more and the game's over. Rebound for Come on, get one. There we go. Fahim, Fahim with another rebound. Burn it up the board. Get another one. There we go. Fahim. Easy work, Oak. Get him out of there, Oak. He's letting him shoot. Come on. Fahim, one more. Nah, it's over. Rebound, Oak. Ten rebounds for Oakley. Four points for Fahim the Dream. You worked hard. Kevin Witt looks like he works at your local law firm and snorts tons of cocaine. I was a coach, coached high school basketball and baseball. Coming down from a horrible cocaine. Night of just key bumps for days, this guy. Look at him. Look at him. Irritable, exhausted, depressed. Oakley can pull down ten more. First ball up, rebound Oakley. Witt. All right, you're, you're the jack of all trades. You're the man, right? take it in the paint. All right. Beautiful. Not so beautiful, I should say. Oakley battles. Rebound Oak. That's two. Oh, come on. down. Rebound Oak. That's three. You can't do that. Put it up. Wit puts it up. Wow. Two points. Take it up, Wit. Yeah, Wit. Oh. No, Wick. Wit needs one basket to tie for him. Two baskets. The Joes are trying to coach him against a world-class basketball legend. I love it. I mean, what else can he do? They're trying. He's trying. Yeah, he gets it. There we go, Wit. One more basket. Kevin Witt's going to overtime. He's pulling his shirt. Oakley's going to let him score. Yeah. He didn't want to have to go to a tiebreaker with these guys. You three are going to overtime against all... Front runner for me is the middle guy with the football background. The guy right in the middle right there. That's my guy. I think he takes the whole thing. I know the guy on the far left is an athlete. He's probably, probably has the best chance of winning, but I'm going to rock with the guy in the middle. First, you're going to be in the ring with Arturo Thunder Gotti. You got to get five clean shots on Gotti, and he will be defending himself. Then, you're moving to the hardwood, taking on the oak, Charles Oakley. You got to get three passes past the all-star and hit the targets. Then, you got to stop Ricky Williams again from scoring. If he scores, you start over again. 60 seconds is your max out time on each event. All right, Donnie, let's go. He talked a lot of shit. Our pros versus oh, Joe's clock is brought to you by Subway Restaurant. You got to hit him back, huh? Fresh. Hit him back. Turo, there we go. You're going to come in playing me like that? Never disrespect me. I catch you with the hook coming in. Four cool. punches already. No. Clock's ticking. Come on. Lance on him. I know Arturo's not supposed to hit him, right? Keeping his guard up. He got him. Five punches. Come on, Dottie. Yo, he's running with the boxing gloves on. He runs to the bench. That's the hardest part right there, man. Running with those gloves on, a mouthpiece in. He got his bell run. Bing! <laughs> Look at the head. Oh. Yeah, the Gave him the whiplash. He's out. Donnie Fraser with the ball. Missed it. 
just off the side. Seven pass. Got it. Target. Yo, you saw Oak? You nice saw move. Oak? That was great. He did a weird kick move. Two that targets. was phenomenal. Fraser. Uh, missed the third target. Fraser still working on the third target. Uh. There we go. Donnie Fraser said a bit of 30's got to stop. Donnie Fraser about to get a bad stinger in his neck. That sucks. Run him over, Williams, just for for the sake of entertainment. Run him over. Come on. Oh yeah. Look at Donnie. Look at Donnie. Good job, Donnie. Donnie Fraser not maxing out on all three events. Good work by Donnie Fraser. Really impressive. Come on, Kevin Witt. Don't show him any respect, Kevin Witt. Look at Kevin Witt. Look at Kevin Witt's technique. Look what he's doing. Come on, hit him. Hit him once. There we go. Yo, what are you doing? This is a man. Probably has kids and he punches like that. Nice hook. Nice hook. Terrible form. Papadakis is hilarious. Nice right hand. Hit him with a combination, just for principle. Boom. Four shots for Kevin Wick. Uh -oh. Five shots for Kevin Wick. Almost a minute. That was close. Horrible time by Kevin Wick. Disgusting boxing. Let's see how his basketball is. Let's see how he does. Okay, I like that overhead situation. Second target. He needs a GPS. Third target. Got it. Come on now, Kevin. Let's go, Kevin Witt. Yo, Kevin Witt's having a heart attack right now. It's a miracle to pass Donnie Fraser. Run him over, Williams, just for principle. There's a move for Ricky. Left in the dust. Reset. <laughs> There's a handoff. Ricky with the move. Cool, stiff arm. Man. Heavy <laughs> stiff no arm. Way. Williams, Ricky you got to give him this one, man. Reset. Surprise. 245. And Ricky Bolos him. Say max out. Run to the finish line, Kevin. Look at the athleticism as he runs. Finish up, Kevin. Three minutes, 16 seconds. That was beat. <laughs> Donnie Fraser. <laughs> Time to beat is two minutes. This is the guy I'm rooting for. I thought he could win, but I don't know if he's that fast, though. I think he might struggle in the basketball. This is a big guy to box, so you gotta be careful. I mean, he's a football player. He's throwing hard shots. Ooh. Ooh. He's throwing hard shots. Yeah, he's gonna have to punch you back. Yeah. The big right for Scotty. Two. Good shot. Mike Hall's got two. Mike Hall's got four. Five. Mike Hall's got five. Get out, Mike. Get out, Mike. Get out, Mike. What an idiot. On the basketball. I actually think he's pretty damn fast, man. All right, let's see how his basketball game is. I don't think we got to see that. Uh, not that this is really basketball, right? This is kind of like a weird side exercise you would do in a creative fighter video game. What is he doing? I hit three. You need another one. Oh my God. You just destroyed your chances of winning. He was doing phenomenal. My call's gotta get three targets. A lack of focus, man. This could have cost him a trip to Los Angeles. He's done. My call maxed out. Get to the finish line, Mike. Oakley's Mike like, that was easy. My call right now sitting at 204. And he lost. Big way. My call. Got the leg of Ricky Williams. No. Oh, and Ricky steps out. Yo, he thought he did good with that tackle, didn't realize that he completely destroyed most of his frontal lobe. He completely fell forward. My call, finish it up with a time of 248. That means Donnie Frazier is going on to the Rose Bowl. Pros versus Joes, what a show. Strangle gang, take care and I'll see you in the next one.